100% the covert narcissist will suffer deeply and die slowly if you know this secret. Have you ever felt stuck in a relationship or situation where you couldn't say anything? The only thing that makes these self-centered people act the way they do is their strong need for control, which they use with cruel accuracy. It's not a surprise that they use shady methods to keep their power, but don't worry, there are ways to avoid getting caught in their complex webs of influence. Today, get ready because we're going to show you 10 situations that would scare even narcissists. Let's jump right in. First, putting your back out. Narcissus addicts love the feeling of being in charge. They enjoy acting like they are invincible and letting their inflated egos shine. They learn how to be master puppeteers and use every chance to their advantage. Getting the confidence to fight back, on the other hand, can free you from their tight grip. Do not allow them to change or control your thoughts. Stand up for yourself and be independent. When you start to question their hidden agendas and stand up for your own rights, the narcissist's carefully built world falls apart, leaving them confused and lost. When they don't get the response they want from you, they may become more angry. Remember that their only goal is to benefit themselves. They skillfully change and control events to get what they want. To win, stay alert to what they're up to and resolutely refuse to give in to their control. Stand tall and be resolute in your desire to keep your freedom. Second, getting out of the narcissist's drama cycle. Sometimes in life, we can get caught up in someone else's problems. Narcissists, on the other hand, don't just like drama sometimes, it's what they're made of. They have a remarkable ability to pull you into their crazy and upsetting situations, which can be hard on your mental health. There is, however, a bright side. You can regain control by stopping their never-ending show. Narcissists seem confident, but they really feel insecure and need to depend on others all the time. Drama becomes their safe place, where they are always looking for approval and attention. You can make it clear that you will not be manipulated by setting clear limits and refusing to take part in their theatrical shows. It might be hard to break free at first, but it's an important step toward keeping your peace of mind in the long run. Do not let yourself get caught in their harmful and mentally draining web. Focus your energy on what really counts and stop all interactions. Number 3. Showing their tricky web. It can be very painful to confront someone about their lies, especially if they are someone you care a lot about. But working with narcissists makes things even more difficult. It's strange how well they can twist the truth to get what they want, and they often make themselves out to be victims, which is a terrible truth that you have to accept. In addition to controlling their thoughts and feelings, they use a variety of other methods to get what they want. But as soon as you point out how dishonest and self-centered they are, they quickly put up walls to protect themselves. Narcissists fight endlessly to keep up their false sense of greatness. They fear weakness and vulnerability more than anything else. 4. Being under scrutiny by the public. Few things scare narcissists more than the thought of being shamed and known in public. They are very easily embarrassed because they are so focused on keeping up an image of perfect greatness. If you make them feel threatened, they go into defense mode right away, desperately trying to keep up the front they've worked so hard to build. When a narcissist takes off their mask in public, they look very different from the haughty persona they try to project. It's common to have friends or co-workers whose bad behavior has gone on for too long without being stopped. Even though it's uncomfortable, confronting this behavior can be the wake-up call they need so badly. Never forget how important it is to hold them responsible for what they do. When you stand up for yourself and talk about the problem directly, you set limits and let them know that their cruel behavior will not be accepted. Fifth, getting good at telling your own story. 
The desire for independence and control is a basic part of what it means to be human. In the case of narcissists, though, this desire for control turns into an unquenchable passion. They are always trying to be dominant and powerful, leaving little room for anyone else to act. Being around a narcissist all the time and having to deal with their expectations can make you lose your sense of who you are. It's important to take back your independence and make it clear that you won't be a pawn in their plans or a passive observer of their whims. You take back control of your life by setting clear limits and claiming your own authority. Don't let the ego tell you what to do or make you feel less important. Take care of your life and make choices that are in line with who you really are. Always remember that your life is a gift that you can shape however you want. Sixth, how to say bad things without being rude. Few things hurt narcissists as much as being criticized, especially when it includes comments about how they look. Because they are deeply insecure about how they look, any opinion on it is a touchy subject. If you criticize their looks, it can break their inflated ego and make it fall even more. Think carefully about what you say if you need to give them feedback on how they look. Avoid any tone that sounds harsh and instead use language that is kind and understanding. For instance, you could politely point out that their outfit doesn't quite match your usual style or you could show worry by asking, is everything okay? You look a little worn out. The seventh tip is to use the power of reserved praise. Being in a relationship with a narcissist who is always looking for approval and recognition can be like an emotionally draining marathon. The constant search for praise can make it hard to make real relationships based on honesty. But not giving a narcissist credit and attention can set off a storm of strong emotions. In order to keep getting love, Narcissists are very good at manipulative behavior and use emotional blackmail. When they aren't given the praise they want, their behavior can quickly become chaotic. You need to understand that you can't change a narcissist's sense of self-worth. How you deal with them is what gives you power. So, withholding praise and attention should be done carefully so that it causes as little stress and disagreement as possible. Don't forget that you don't owe anyone your love, time or energy. Set clear limits and take care of yourself to put your own health first. Eighth, the veil of deceit pulled back. Watching a loved one go through hard times can be very hard on the heart. But seeing how a narcissist manipulates others makes things even more complicated. These people are good at pretending to be victims to get attention and they use a variety of methods to get what they want. It's important to understand that you are not responsible for how a narcissist feels. Narcissists will do everything they can to make you believe otherwise, but any criticism is seen as an attack on their self-worth. They can't see their own flaws because they are so focused on getting praise. You don't have to agree with what they're doing or put your own safety at risk, though. It's not your job to fix someone who stubbornly refuses to fix themselves. Number nine, have to get through stormy seas. Dealing with a narcissist while staying calm is hard, but it's very important to do so. These people enjoy causing trouble and often start fights and arguments. On the other hand, you can restore control by controlling how you feel. It is important to understand that narcissists are great at manipulating others and will take any chance to show they are in charge. They might say or do things on purpose to get you to react. By not reacting, you make them less powerful, which makes them look for attention somewhere else. They are making you mad, which is normal, but you need to stop playing their mind games. You are not required to interact with someone who does not make your life better. Remember that narcissists are not to blame for what they do. Number 10. Showing the trick. Narcissists are pros at lying and knowing how to hide their fake selves in any way possible. 
Taking off their mask can make them act in ways that range from anger to fear or violence. Their whole sense of self depends on these made-up characters, and they are always looking for approval from the people around them. Sadly, this never-ending need for praise often hurts the people nearest to them. By figuring out the behaviours of narcissists and spotting their signs, you give yourself the power to set limits that protect your health. It might seem scary to talk to a narcissist, but it's important not to let their self-centeredness cloud your judgement. They put on a show of grandeur, but deep down they are weak and have low self-esteem. By being strong and speaking out about your emotions and feelings, you start a path of healing and personal growth. Because narcissists put a lot of work into keeping up their false personas, finding out who they really are may cause them worry and stress. But you have the power to show them for who they really are and get your sense of worth back. It can be hard to deal with narcissists, but it's important to be prepared by having the right information and tools. You can stay up to date and join ongoing conversations by subscribing to our channel or writing a comment below. We can fight narcissistic abuse and make relationships better if we work together. Your help is very much valued and is very important.